Good afternoon everybody on YouTube. This is Rick Thomas from Obsolete Video Services. Today we're doing some video transfers of a customer job I just got today. Um, these are reel-to-reel -reel skip field, which is uh, another reel-to-reel -reel video format from around 1967-69. Uh, this is a reel-to-reel -reel that looks a lot like the EIAJ reel-to-reels, but they're totally two different formats, which I've posted on earlier videos. But today I want to show you some of the quality we can actually do. As you can see, it's going through, playing it through my, uh, my Sony CV2200, through my, my setup, which is my time based corrector and switching and everything else in ProRes, to the monitor. As you can see, we're getting really good video playback. Also to PC, which is what they want, PC files. And this is skip field reel-to-reel. -reel. Uh, video. These never did really play really, really good, but I got two really good working machines and I serviced them. And these play the skip field format really, really good quality considering what it is for the time. But um, these are really, really uh, hard tapes to do because these machines never had tracking devices on them so you could track the video. And the video, if the video was done on any other type of skip field, you would have a problem transferring them. But as you can see, I'm feeding it through time-based correction and switching, playing it on my monitor and my computer monitor, and everything is transferring really, really well. Skip field is a very, very hard tape format to do. This is a CV2200. I own two of these machines, and I could do skip field uh, transfers with no problem. So if you have skip field reel-to-reel -reel uh, tapes, they're black and white from early 67 through 69, we can do them. The tapes generally came in these plastic cases. As you can see, these white cases, they were round. They were a very brown type of tape, very early videotape. And that's the sure signs of knowing it was done on a very early reel-to-reel -reel machine, like a skip field. As you can see, I have a few of them over here that I'm getting to. I've got three or four of these I have to transfer off. Uh, these tapes weren't very good quality, but as you can see, my machine does transfer these off because uh, my machines actually work and through my system and time-based correction which this machine never did really work very well through time-based correction if you even had one that would work my machine actually plays these tapes very well through my system so if you have a skip field uh, reel-to-reel -reel tapes and they're in these cases and you don't know if they are skip field or EIAJ contact uh, Obsolete video services. We'll see what we can do to help you out, but most generally we should be able to transfer them to a file, ProRes, whatever you might have, you might want to have done. But these are CV2200 skip field tapes on a customer job I'm doing today. Hope you enjoyed this video.